Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Today I will review a 4K TV unfamiliar to most consumers. The brand name is Element. This manufacturer provides decent and very inexpensive 4K LED HDR TVs. Sure, their TVs can't truly compete with the likes of Samsung, LG, and Sony nor were they designed to do so. That being said, Element TVs do what they're supposed to do within their design parameters and they do it quite well. One of the reasons I decided to do this video is to attest to the fact that Element makes a decent TV after having watched lots of movies and YouTube videos on an Element TV that belongs to a very close friend who has owned an Element TV for several years without any issues. The picture quality is decent, and over the years I haven't found much to complain about for such a low-cost TV. Now let's move on to the TV featured in this video, the Element 450 Series 4K LED TV. Starting at a retail price of just over $200 for the 43-inch model, makes it an ideal choice for budget-conscious consumers. The Element 450 series comes in a range of sizes to perfectly suit any living space, from cozy apartments to spacious living rooms. Choose from a compact 43-inch model to an expansive 86-inch display, each designed to seamlessly blend into your home decor. The series boasts a modern, minimalist aesthetic appeal featuring a frameless bezel design. This slim frame design minimizes distractions and draws your focus into the on-screen action. Now, moving on to the features the 450 series has to offer. This TV delivers pristine 4K picture resolution and adds HDR10 high dynamic range. HDR boosts contrast and picture brightness in addition to producing more vibrant true-to-life colors. I'll talk more about this TV's HDR performance later. Up next, this TV offers the Google TV Smart TV platform. The Google TV OS will allow you to find shows across 10,000 plus apps or to browse 300 free live TV channels and thousands of free movies. You can use your voice to find content with the supplied voice remote control. Functionally, I found the Google TV OS to be generally smooth and glitch-free, although it wasn't as fast compared to my Sony TV which also uses the Google TV interface. I believe this was caused by the limited amount of internal memory and storage space available on the Element TV. This TV also has Chromecast built-in and is now called Google Cast. This feature worked well when casting content from my smartphone to the TV without any issues. The Element 450 series also features Dolby Audio which prevents jumps in volume as you switch content or go from broadcast programs to commercial breaks. It's also designed to deliver better audio quality, but it didn't make much of a difference on the Element 450 due to the TV's speakers which don't produce high-quality sound output. And last but not least on the features list is the TV's built-in Bluetooth connectivity. This allows Bluetooth-enabled devices, such as soundbars, wireless headphones, speakers, and smartphones to connect wirelessly to the TV. I didn't have any issues using the TV's Bluetooth connectivity, and speaking of connectivity, this TV is equipped with four HDMI inputs, an eARC input, two USB inputs, a composite mini AV input, one audio input, a digital audio output, and an Ethernet input. The heart of any television lies in its picture quality, and the Element 450 series does a commendable job in this crucial area of performance, especially for 4K TVs at these price points. For this review I used the 43-inch model, the E450AD43G. Now getting right to the point, I was pleasantly surprised at how good the overall picture was from the Element 450. However, I must state that the picture quality straight out of the box wasn't very good in my opinion, but after some minor tweaking within the TV's picture menu, I was able to bring the picture quality to life. For example, when watching high-quality video clips from select movie scenes in high-quality 4K outdoor landscapes on YouTube, I was treated to images with stunning detail and clarity, with impressive image transparency. This TV also delivered solid color reproduction. 4K and 1080p resolution movies, TV shows, and video clips produced a vibrant color palette with admirable color accuracy. The Element 450 also has commendable contrast which allows for deep blacks. However, on the downside, this TV doesn't have an LED local dimming feature which would have improved contrast and black levels. Next up is HDR performance. When viewing high-quality HDR content on this TV, the results were good, but when compared to my high-end Sony TV, the Element 450 fell short of what a great HDR picture image should look like. This shortcoming was primarily due to the TV's lack of high-peak brightness output. This caused images to be less vibrant and colorful and bright specular highlights didn't stand out. There was also less detail and clarity and less image depth and transparency. 
So if you desire a TV that can produce bright and dynamic HDR picture images, you should choose a TV capable of producing high peak brightness output. Next, motion handling was decent on this TV for a panel with a refresh rate of 60 Hz. When watching fast action movie content, I didn't notice any motion artifacts such as motion blur. However, with some fast paced sporting events I did see some slight motion blur. Additionally, there is a fair amount of contrast and color saturation loss when viewing this TV at wide viewing angles which is common with TVs that use VA panels. For the record, I didn't do any gaming evaluation on this TV which I don't usually do, nor could I find any relevant info about the TV's gaming capabilities. In conclusion, the Element E 450AD43G is a solid performing 4K TV with an array of useful and sought after features including Google TV OS. Its overall picture quality was very good, especially for a TV at the $200 price point. The TV's detail and clarity were very good, whereas its color rendering delivered a vibrant and well-saturated color palette, and its contrast and black level performance were commendable. I also liked its sleek, frameless bezel design which adds aesthetic appeal to its appearance. It's obvious the Element 450 series has a lot to offer. But it does however have a few drawbacks with my top complaint being its lack of peak brightness output when viewing HDR content. Other minor complaints are its contrast and color saturation loss when viewing the TV from the sides, and minor motion blur with some fast action sporting events such as basketball games. Some will say Element TVs should be avoided, but I suggest you check them out before you dismiss the brand. To sum up, I recommend the Element 450 series to consumers who don't mind purchasing an unfamiliar brand and who desire a decent 4K TV with good performance and the mainstream features that most people look for in a new TV, all at a cost that is well below most other budget brand TVs. If you found the content in this video informative, please like and subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell for more tech videos. And please check out HDTVs and more.com for more tech-related content. Thanks for watching.